Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to make a simple health bar like the one that we have here. Let's get started. I'm just going to delete that and then go into start a GUI, add a screen GUI, and then name it health bar. Add a frame into there, name it holder, then drag it down, make it about the size that your health bar wants to be. Put mine like that doesn't have to be perfect then I'm just gonna add another frame inside that I'm just gonna make it the same dimensions and everything as that and then once you have that done I get this frame and then just put the color as green and get this frame which is called holder and put the color as red and then that will be what our health bar looks like right now you can take some time to customize it if you want to make it look better and at the end of the video I'll show you how you can make the edges look curve so then just go inside the frame and add a local script and then inside of that just write weight then 0 0.3 then go inside of this while true do then write local hp equals game dot players dot local player dot character dot humanoid dot health divide by 100 then just go another line below and then write script dot parent colon tween size then parentheses and then our pair of parentheses and then write u dim to dot new then get another pair of parentheses put hp zero comma one comma zero and then go outside those parentheses two of the parentheses and then put a comma enum dot easing direction dot out comma enum dot easing style right there and then dot quad then comma 0 0.5 0 0.15 and then end of parentheses then we just want a weight so then put the weight as 0 0.2 and then now let's test it out so if this works correctly when I reset health bar should go down like that so now we got it fully working and I'm going to show you how you can make the edges curved just go into the toolbox and then go into plugins and then just search GUI on there and then you'll see GUI reg rounded I already have that downloaded but you can download that there should be the button right here I gotta update it but once you have that downloaded go into your plugins and then you should see it right there then go to this one go to plugins go to the slider and then I'm just gonna put mine all the way for now and then go to the airframe and put yours as much as you want then it will be curved and it will act exactly as we had earlier just like this when I hit reset it will go down just like that and it's rounded um, but of course you can customize it way more you can add completely different effects you can do alright so I was editing mine and I made it look super cool so you can leave the video now or I can show you how I made mine cool with like background transparencies taking the color away and all that kind of stuff so I just selected both of these then I went to the plugins I got my slider and then I took it to zero then I brought up one because I just wanted a little bit of slide then I brought both the these down just a little bit so then it was like that which is already looking really good and then I got the holder right here which was the background and I made it to where it was like white and it was gray and then I got this one and I made it to where the color is like a little darker green kind of like that and then I selected both of these and I made it to where the background transparency was at 0.5 so that's how I made mine look super cool and let me show you it in action when you die. Okay so while you're playing it looks super cool right here it's all nice and tidy but then when you respawn it looks like this. All of it goes down it's a nice great background so I recommend you having this like that but obviously have it however you want because it's your game you get to do whatever you want. And yeah anyways thanks for watching please make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you in the next video.